Hiya. This post is very short. It's just a poem, a poem called Raised in Rhyme that I've posted before, but I'm posting it today partly because I think some of the thoughts in it might be helpful to some people at the moment, because it's about the comfort that nature can offer us in the trials of life, but also because it's got a verse about DNA. Uh, and I'm just about to publish a book called Grow, with illustrations by Emily Sutton, which is about DNA. And DNA, actually, if you study its chemistry and how it works, is all about rhyming. And there are lots of rhymes in nature at all levels, from the very tiny and microscopic to the big. And there are rhymes in nature that run right the way through time as well. OK, so here's the poem. Raised in rhyme. I was born out in the wilderness, beneath a sky of cold, with a sword for my deliverance and no human hand to hold. But the constellations rocked me in the rhythm of all time, and I stood up, glad to be alive, raised in rhyme. I tried my feet upon the ground, but I couldn't find a way. I wandered in confusion, never knowing night from day. But a woodlark and a nightingale sang out to show the line that lies between the dark and light and raised me up in rhyme. I waited by the mountain, I waited by the sea, never was there anybody waiting there for me. But the waves and trees and flowers swayed and shone with such a shine that my heart just kept on dancing because I was raised in rhyme. The tangled green of jungle, the ocean's deepest blue, the tardigrade, the python, and the bouncing kangaroo. All of life's a lyric in a song of the sublime, written in one language and raised up in a rhyme. I lift my head to sunset, feel its warmth upon my face. I know that when I'm gone from here, I won't leave a trace. But I am filled with poems, moon and stars in every line. I'm a baby of the universe because I was raised in rhyme. <laughs>